So like lots of other people during this lockdown, I'm trying to find ways to enjoy um, the nature I have around me and what I have at home. And one thing I'm very lucky to have is some um, emperor moths, which I reared as caterpillars last summer and have spent the winter in a cocoon. So I just wanted to share them with you because they're starting to emerge and I thought you might like to see some pictures. So first I wanted to show you this beautiful male. You can see he's got orange underwings just peeping out and then these beautiful eye spots on each forewing. And if you look closely, can you see his antennae are really feathery? And that's so he can detect, he uses it kind of to smell when there are females nearby. And I'm very excited because uh, today this absolutely stunning female emperor moth emerged and she's absolutely beautiful. You can see she's still got the eye spots like the male has, but underneath her hind wings are a much darker colour. They're similar colour to the fore wings. And that's because she only really flies at night. So in the day, she sits quite low in some vegetation and she lets out this pheromone smell to attract males. If you notice her antennae, are much thinner than the males and that's because she doesn't need to use them to smell over quite such large distances as the males. So I hope you enjoyed finding out a little bit more about emperor moths. Um, the female has laid some eggs so I'm hoping to do a future film on the caterpillars as they emerge and hopefully capture them uh, growing. Uh, in the meantime, if you'd like to know more, have a look on our website, which is www.butterfly-conservation.org um, for more information and loads of resources, including um, information on how to build your own moth trap, if you'd like to have a go at that.